Well, this is amazing. You can go from an idea to completely built web application within a day. And this is something I tested myself and built this complete website, which is not just a landing page. It is a complete SaaS application. Now this has payments. It has the authentication system where someone can sign up, make an account. They could see all the courses and it has two different section. If you're an instructor, you can see option to create courses. And if you're a student, you can browse courses and see what's available. Right now, I just had my bootcamp that was launched last year. It is available as part of this SaaS application. There are a few preview videos for users to know about the course and learn a little more. Then there are the courses which are locked, which requires payment. So payments are also integrated using Stripe. And all of this is built using Vibe coding or prompt based coding. So the way I start is there are multiple templates available on GitHub. You can just take one of these templates. And this template here by McKay is quite nice because it provides some instructions. It tells you the tools that are going to be used in this template. And also it has a cursor rules folder, which is what we're going to be using in cursor. It basically helps cursor know how to proceed. If you notice, there are a few different files, which are basically rules for cursor. We can open some of these and see what's happening inside. So these are general instructions for cursor to follow. Now I brought over this repo to cursor using the git clone option. And with that, I had it open locally on my computer and then I start prompting. And if you notice in the history, there are multiple composer as well as chat windows that I had went through. And these are detailed instructions and chat and back and forth communication, just letting cursor know what I'm looking to build. And then cursor makes changes and we can view that in a browser. And then with that, we can keep making changes until it's ready as a website. And once that is completed, you'll see a lot of files those are created by Cursor Composer. And this is something with Cursor, you don't necessarily have to be a pro at coding or even someone who have worked with coding before. You can learn while you are Vibe coding. So that's the benefit of using this technique. Now, if you want to learn how to build a website like this, I am working on a new course, which will take you through the first steps all the way to building a complete web application and deploying that. Follow along to learn how you can also build similar applications applications and deploy your own SaaS within a few days.